Hi, and welcome to my crypto mining portfolio. Today was a really good week. We mined 0.12 ETH. The price on those coins went down a little bit, but overall we're still looking really good. This is where we are at after five weeks of mining. $343.18. Now this is gross income because we haven't taken into account for power cost yet. But the good news is, today's the day we figure that out. So I just got this in a mail, it's the kilowatt meter. You just plug one end of the wall, one end into your rig, and boom, you know exactly how much watts it's taking because the software just isn't accurate on this kind of thing. So I got this one because it came with this extra little extension cord and it has all kinds of different settings. You can put in your power cost and it'll say over the last three hours this device has consumed this many watts, so this is your overall cost. It's a really cool little device and I've actually been using it on other things around the house just seeing, you know, what we need to upgrade in the future and what's efficient and what's not. So it turns out the Xbox One S is actually really efficient. So who would have known? You can find that link in the description if you're interested in it. So after plugging in the kilowatt meter, the range seems to be from 869 to high 70s. So we're just going to round up to 880 for the power cost assumption. And as you can see here in the software, we're showing 699. And I have seen this as high as 704. Depends on the temperature of the room, how hard the fans are going, if I've changed any of these settings. But right now, I'm really, really happy with that number because the 1070 Ti's aren't exactly known to be the most efficient cards in the world. We're going to average up to 880 watts, 24 hours a day at a 9.6 cent rate. So we're going to hit calculate here, moment of truth. All right, $2.02 .02 a day to keep this rig going for 24 hours straight. Now this calculator doesn't show me the weekly cost, which is what I'm most interested in. So here we've got $14.14. .14. So we've been mining for five weeks and that's a total of $70.70. .70. So overall profits is $272.48. 43.18. Ooh, just over 20%. That's actually really good. That's a clean, easy number to remember. To make my portfolio safer, I'm going to go on the crypto.com app and transfer some of my mined coins into a stable coin. I'm going to use USDC, which is just a coin backed by a US dollar because I can stake it on crypto.com for 10% APY. I'll show you the app when I actually go about doing it, but I can stake it for 10% a year. And that way, if Bitcoin or Ethereum or wherever I keep it goes way down, I can never go negative on my power cost because that would just be silly and a risk that I'm not willing to take. Just be losing money every month for no reason. So I'm gonna put it into this here, USD coin, it's really safe. It'll do it through crypto.com because they have the best APY for that coin. And yeah, that's the game plan for right now. So thanks for watching guys. I have the link to that kilowatt meter in the description and a link to the crypto.com app, which you can get $50 for signing up. It helps me out too. And yeah, that's it for this week. Next week is gonna be even more exciting. So stay tuned.